I was there for uh, the president when he signed the executive order back uh, over a year ago now in uh, Arizona. And so to come see this come to fruition, I think is very important. Uh, I'm excited because it's actually something that's going to deliver for us here in the Central Valley. You know, and the sad thing is, is everyone's going to focus on the politics, but we, we've got to focus on what's going on here on the ground. This is something that's actually going to be beneficial to the Central Valley. It's something that's going to be beneficial to our communities and our farmers. And as I was, and when I was a member of Congress, and you saw communities like Kettleman or communities like uh, a, a Chapter and others in Delano, all struggling for water, no one cared who the President of the United States was. What they cared about was making sure that water was being delivered. And what's being done here today actually does turn on the pumps, moves water south, and actually does a real big difference for us in the Central Valley. It's a benefit. And for all the naysayers, I know the governor wants to make the decision to take this on, but anyone that makes the decision to sue or to take this down has to remember that this is something that's going to benefit 25 million Californians. Do they really want to challenge something in court that was started under the Obama administration? It was career staff that developed it, and this administration continued on. The only thing that this president did was he put it in uh, high gear. He wanted to see this get done quick because he knew how important it was. We had a great year in 2019, but 20, uh, 2020 is already looking pretty dry. And so that for this to come at this timely uh, moment is really important for us.